On Sunday, Vaan is sleeping really peacefully when she feels something disturbing to her. She woke up in severe cramps in her belly. She rushed to the washroom immediately. She said, I thought I'll spend my weekend with enjoying these days. But this happened to me. Oh my God. Vaan opened her cupboard, photographs and repaired there. But there's no pad left. Then she tries to find pad in bedside table. But they are not there. I think I have to buy them new. But my brother is not at home. What can I do now? Vaan opened her phone lock, screen lock. Without seeing whom she is going to text. She texted first contact with her cold boss. Actually, she wanted to text her younger brother. Who bought her sanitary pads every month when she needed it doesn't feel anything like hesitation in this matter. When she texted her CEO, Vine, hey my boy, CEO, yes, Miss Vine, oh, why you are calling me, Miss? Disrespect, why, my boy? I give you respect every time, Miss Vine. Whatever, listen, can you buy me sanitary pads, nine piece regular pack immediately? Because I really need them. Miss Vyan, why are you asking me to buy them for you? I think you texted me mistakenly. No, I texted you. I don't know anything. Bring me pads immediately. I'm dying with these bullshit cramps. You. Vyan, check contact name again. I'm your CEO, Jion Jankook. Oh God, I'm really sorry, sir. Please, I'm sorry. It's okay. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Vine sat on her bed with a cursed face, saying to herself, How idiot I am. Why I texted him. It's really embarrassing. Now what will happen? Oh my God, Vine, what you did? Vine, such a nice start of my weekend. You sat there like a statue in embarrassment. John Jankook is the CEO of Rise Enterprises, which is top listed in Korean companies. And you are working as her personal assistant from past 2.5 years now. Jankook is a gentleman but with a cold personality. Vine came to her senses when the doorbell rang outside. She wanted to know who's there. So Vine opened the door. After that, she stayed in shock because Jankook was standing over there. Vine, sir, you? Yes, it's me, Miss Vine. Jankook is in black pants and a grey sweatshirt. That's the first time when Vine sees him into casual outfits. Vine, why are you here? What? I came to your house for the first time and you are asking me why? Seriously, Miss Vine? You are not inviting me inside? Oh no, sir. Sorry, sorry. Please. Come inside. He entered while he handed a black wrap bag to you. Vine, what is this, sir? Jankook, this is what you are asking about on text. Okay, sir, just wait. I'm coming in a few minutes. Vine was silently bear the pain of cramps while standing over there. She rushed to the washroom where she used that sanitary napkin. Vine changed her clothes and wore a comfortable one. With soft slippers, she came outside while Jungkook was staring at the photos hanging on the wall. Miss Vine, tell me about your family. Introduce them. Sir, my parents are living in Seoul, but my brother is living here with me just for his studying purpose. Jungkook, oh, okay, sir, can I ask you something? First of all, stop calling me, sir. Every time, because we are not in the office right now. You can call me, Jankook. Oh, oh, Jankook? So how you found my house? Of course, from your resume of idea. It was not any tough task, you know. Oh, sorry, I forgot to ask. You wanna have some tea, coffee or any drink? Jankook, coffee will be fine. 
Vain quickly goes to the kitchen and start making coffee while she was feeling quite nervous because his call her call boss tried to get friendly with her Vain take the coffee mug and handed it to Jan Cook Jan Cook take a sip of coffee oh it's nice Vain thank you suddenly she is feeling a harsh pain of cramps in her lower body she screamed lightly and gently rubbed her belly while jankok put his coffee mug aside and came to vain are you okay uh, yes is it cough cramps vain nodded yes jankok picked up you in his muscular arms and bring to your bedroom in a bridal style vain became shocked to see this jankok laid down you on your bed and cover your body with the help of a blanket Where is the hot water bottle? It's okay, Jankook. No, I'm fine. You don't need to do anything more. Where it is? Tell me, please, Jankook asked. It's here in this side drawer. You are feeling really, really bad because Jankook came to your home for the first time, and this all is really embarrassing for you. That he is doing now. After a few minutes, he came into the room with a hot water bottle and also with some chocolates. With he bought, which he bought for you with sanitary pads. Vain take the hot bag and place it over her body. Gent, it place it over her belly gently. While Jan Cook sat there on a corner couch, this is my first time to buy anything like that, so I have no idea about your choices. That's why. I picked all type of chocolates for you. Now take your favorite one in them and tell me, what do you like the most? These all are very good chocolates, and all are my favorite. Jan Cook, oh God, thank God, you like them. He smiled. Vain, did you just smile? Jan Cook shocked because this is very first time when you are seeing. I'm smiling. Jan Cook is cold like an ice cream. Vain asked again. You smiled right now. Jan Cook, I can't believe. Jan Cook nodded his head with a smile again. Oh my God, you are smiling again. I wish I could capture these beautiful moments. Vain took her phone immediately and said, "Smile, Jan Cook, please, Jan Cook, smile again for me." Jan Cook smiled while seeing her childish ex. Vain captured many photos of Jan Cook. In a few seconds, these are just perfect. Vain shouted happily. This was the first time when I saw you while smiling. You look really cute. You should smile more often. He stood up from couch and go from your room. After a few seconds, you heard the sound of gate closing. This means he went back. Vain was thinking that he minded something about her childish behavior, and it anyways. She lay down and relaxing herself. On Monday, when she came to office, Jan Cook was not came today. He went to another country for important deals and business meetings. Vain start missing him because she is strong feeling of likeness towards him. Vain daily wait for Jan Cook, but he was not still coming back from tour. She was restless without him. After one month, on the same date when Vain got her periods last month, today is the same date when her periods came. This time also, she hadn't any sanitary pads in the home. She again forgot to buy them. Vain, how stupid I am! Again, I did same mistake. Suddenly, doorbell rang. Vain opened the door when she saw Jan Cook there. She hugged him tightly. Vain, where were you, Jan Cook? I missed you so much. These thirty days, you have no idea how I spent them. Please don't go again like this. I am in love with you, Jan Cook. Please stay with me. Jan Cook, I love you too, Vain. He smiled. I'll tell you everything later, but first grab these pads and go to washroom. Oh, but how do you know? I got my periods now.
बिकॉज इट्स द डेट वेन लास्ट मंथ यू गॉट दैम हे विंक्ट ओ ओके खम इन साइड शी गोज टू वॉशरूम एंड केम बैक आफ्टर फाइव मिनट वायर जन को वॉज मेकिंग कॉफी फॉर बॉथ ऑफ दैम वाई एंड वाई आर यू डूइंग दिस जन खक जन कुक स्टार्ट किसिंग हर लिप्स विदाउट लिसनिंग टू हर हे पिक्ड हर अप एंड मेक हर लेट डाउन ऑन खाउच जन कुक गेट्स होट वाटर बैग एंड प्लेस इट जेंटली ऑन वाई एंड वैली then he came closer to her and sucked her lips without letting her breathe properly why in heart it is very high i can hear it clearly jan cook i have loved you wine for a long time but i was afraid to confess this now i am not going anywhere i love you too she was in shock after hearing this truth jan cook start kissing her neck slowly now wine start blushing both of them lived happily after that thank you for watching